We lost the war. I, lo I saw my brothers and sisters, my friends and compatriots, the people that I had loved and had known my all my existence die. Or worse, I had to watch them kill. This terrible war was nothing more than a feud over differences. This simple war where the battlefield were literally littered with bodies and numerous was over something so simple. Freedom. Freedom. This senseless war whose ramifications will be felt and talked about throughout the times around was over something so simple as to who do we owe alliance to? Do we owe to filthy mongrels that toil in the soil or to ourselves and our right to do what we deemed is best? No one should tell us. That those should be slaves are no more. Those sort of laws should not govern us. We should govern ourselves. And so over a, the simple idea, the war began. We stood up with the voice of one who roared as legions, as the shakes of the very foundation of the heavens. We picked up our weapons and fought, fought for what we believed in. We perforted the bodies of our brethren, who are now our enemies. With heavy and tear-laden hearts, we could see in each other's eyes, brother against brother, blood against blood. The tears of sorrow disappointment at what we had to do. Though no one should stand in the way of what is right, it does not make the price told any expensive. The battlefield reigned with the crimsons of our ferocity, the clashing screamings of brothers screaming for freedom while others screamed for loyalty, making the fen fending sound rivaling that of a thunderstorm. I remember meeting my brothers on the battlefield. So many words of love and lost on both our dry and, and tired lips as we attempted to kill one another. Face to face, blow against blow, each one making us weep. And though we fought for viciously, I found myself the victor impaling him upon a blade holding him down and swept in his final words. So you were wrong, I forgive you. And I wondered, would I have said the same saying, had it been my chest that leaked vital fluids upon the battlefield? Though there were many civil wars that fought for our side, we did not have the numbers. For we, for every one of us, there were two of them, for every rebel, there were two loyalists, and we could not fight those odds. I lost hope as I fought, as I watched us fall on the battlefield, as our brothers ran us through. My last memories of the war before I finally fell <clears throat> was hearing our leader. He was upon a mound of loyalist bodies. Fighting tooth and nail against their general, their general screams his cry like a trumpet. Our leader roared in defiance like a dragon. Until finally, he fell too. And now we find ourselves in a place I thought of as an eternal punishment for doing what I had thought was right. I find myself languishing in a hell for killing my own brothers for our different beliefs. Here on this hell, we will stay until kingdom comes. Here where we few, like stars that had been swept up by a great dragon's tail. Here where we fell like lightning from heaven.